Hello everyone, welcome to Storycraft Studio. Today we're going to be making this trendy black and rainbow wig for my model doll. We start by selecting our yarn. I picked a few strands of red, orange, yellow, green, blue, purple, and pink for the undercolor. But for the main color I chose this really fluffy black yarn. 100% acrylic is a must if you want to get it to do what you want. Next, you loop them onto something. Before I used a stick or length of yarn, but I saw someone using a hanger and decided I'd try it. It works pretty well if you don't overload it like I have. Oy. After they're all looped, you use a pet brush to separate the fibers. I somehow lost the recording for that, so let's move on to the next step. Brushed off fibers still have a lot of kink, but a fire iron fixes that beautifully provided you don't set it too high or linger, melting the fibers. I managed to avoid that on all these wefts, which is such a good thing. And honestly, rare. Next, we build the wefts. First, I lay down some glue much wider than I think the weft will be, because they always plump up when quite. Then, I take the weft between my fingers and sip it off. Next, I press the cut ends into the glue, squirt more, and brush it in to get each fiber set. Use plenty of glue to bind the fibers and create a strong base. I used Elmer's glue, but I think I'll look into some Mod Podge in the near future. It takes about a day for the glue to dry, so let's move on to making the cap. First, you wrap the head in plastic to protect it. Then, take a piece of fabric, something with give, like t-shirt cotton, and use an elastic to hold it down. Try to get it as flat as possible for the best fit. I never managed that myself. Once it's nice and taut, apply glue. Usually three layers will do, but my glue was watered down for paper mache, so I did four. Back to the wefts. Once they're dry, you peel them off, chop up the excess, and they're ready to go. With everything ready, we start gluing the wefts to the cap. I tried to use Elmer's glue, but it took too long to dry, so I pulled out my trusty hot glue gun. Love this thing, even if it burns me. Somehow, I forgot to record the part where I actually glue this, so let's skip to the cutting. I need practice at this. I plan to just curl the whole thing, but the black yarn either doesn't take to curling, or I just did it wrong. So I started trimming, but um, as I said, I need work on this. I got impatient and started chopping at it to make a bob. Was this the best idea? No! Do I regret it? A little. But as it's only one of the wigs I'll be making for my model doll, I'm okay with it. Someday I'll come back and fix it up when I've figured out what the heck I'm doing. As for the next one, I'll put in a bit more thought. To finish, I wrap the wig in cling wrap to tame the hair and let it sit overnight. And that's how it went. Like and subscribe for more, but if you can't wait, check out my previous doll videos. Thanks for watching!